Bran. Botham Jean's younger brother, Bran, stunned the courtroom with this moment of strength and grace. And I'm speaking for myself, not even bad for my family. But I love you just like anyone else. And I'm not going to say I hope you rot and die just like my brother did, but I see, I, I personally want the best for you. And I, I wasn't going to ever say this in front of my family or anyone, but I don't even want you to go to jail. I want the best for you. Because I know that's what that's exactly what both of them would want you to do. Judge Tammy Kemp in tears as he turned to her with an unusual request. Can I give her a hug, please? Please. Moments later, the judge handing a Bible to Geiger, speaking with her, imploring her to change. Outside the courtroom, outrage from those who felt the 10-year sentence was far too short. Prosecutors had asked for 28. Botham's age, his birthday, would have been this week. Justice! Now! Justice! Geiger's defense team believes the sentence was appropriate. They got to see true remorse that she had. Uh, and in the end, I think that uh, played a big part in the 10-year sentence rather than something much more lengthy that the prosecution wanted. Jean's family telling us they hope their son's death will force the Dallas Police Department to re-examine its training methods. I believe that something needs to be done, revisit some of the procedures, some of the way of handling some of these situations. I sincerely believe that. And I hope this, what occurred with my son, will bring that change.